Hey everybody, it's the Lotto King. How are ya? <laughs> I just finished this red strawberry ale. This is only 5% alcohol, but then I put like two shots of my apple cider serpent bite whiskey. I really can't feel my face right now, but I thought this would be a perfect time to tell you all about this. I found this on YouTube earlier. It popped up on my feed. And I figured out why we're not winning. I think we all need to go to bed tonight and listen to this. It is, I have won the lottery. Lottery success. Supercharge affirmations. It's from Rockstar Affirmations. So apparently you're supposed to play this. And then you're supposed to win. You're going to win the lottery. If you tell yourself this, you're going to win the lottery. Alright, here we go. Hold on. i got to get my keyboard. Take my keyboard condom off here. We'll, let's see if we can play this. I am so happy that I have now won the lottery. I am so grateful to have won the lottery. It is so amazing to win the lottery. All my friends and family are so close for me that I have won the lottery. I am so happy and grateful that I have now won the lottery. I am so happy that I have won millions and millions of dollars. It is so awesome. Millions! Now won millions and millions of dollars. I can't wait to buy all the cool stuff that I have always wanted. I am so grateful to have now won millions and millions of dollars. I am so happy that I am now a multi millionaire. Multi millionaire! I am now a multi millionaire. I am so happy that I have millions of dollars. I am so happy and grateful that I now have more money than I know what to do with. More money than I know what to do with. So you got this. This is 30 minutes long and it goes on and on and on. You want to go check this out. I'll put a link to it down in the description below. But, oh my gosh. So, so apparently that's the thing. That's why we're not winning. You know, you have to. The tickets are sour. All the PA scratchers keep saying the tickets are sour. And they are sour. I will tell you that today. I went on a streak of... Yeah. I, um... I'm going away next weekend, and usually I record my next week's video on Friday night, and I'm leaving Friday, so I bought my tickets, and it's been a tough go. I did get some decent wins in there. I mean, I'm not just saying the upcoming weeks are going to be crappy, but, I mean, it's, I mean, then I would buy extra tickets, and I'm like, well, let's see, maybe I can get a better win for that day, and it's been, it was tough. So apparently, we need to play this, and then we'll learn how to you know, we tell ourselves that we won, we can win. I have more money than I could ever spend. What the, and then, this is the best part. Hold on. Let's go to the comments. I love this one. But uh why is it when I finish listening to this, I feel like running down the highway at 55 miles an hour and ripping the bumper off a semi with my teeth? <laughs> I know. I started listening to it, and I actually took him back to scratch me off, and I let him listen to it. He's like, get it off. I was like, it, it kind of is like mind control, mind control, like Jesse Ventura, mind control. But, Yeah. Maybe I need to start having a Saturday night chat with the Lotto community. I do one on my Send Pen Traveler community. We t I just re this is what I did before this, where I wasn't near as drunk as I am now. We talked about um, I gave my opinion on the all the whole police shootings this week and stuff. Which usually it's on stupid stuff, and I don't try to get you know that's a edgy topic, and I don't want to make anybody mad with my comments. I mean, I'm a pretty open person, but. But anywho, yeah. So there you go. So I will put a link to that in the description down below. You're going to want to listen to that before you go to bed tonight. You know, nah. I'm going to win the PA million, rap billion, PA million raffle tonight too. So hopefully I win a million dollars. Maybe a hundred thousand. I'd be okay with that. And speaking of I guess this could kind of relate into a lottery chat. I watched on HGTV last night. They had... um. 
basically it was these lottery winners and they were looking for houses. So if you've ever watched HGTV, they like house hunters. This was house hunters for people that won the lottery. So you had these people, they won a million dollars on a $20 scratch off. Okay, you know, that's awesome. After taxes, what, 700000 give or take? They were looking at houses between five and $800,000. And they lived with their mother-in-law. It's like, it's not like they had a job that they could, you know, supplement that. No, no, maybe, you know. I watched another one where they did a second chance, I think, and somehow they won like $2 million, which was awesome. You know, yeah, they were looking for houses like eight, nine 900000 you're like, yeah, I get that. You know, and they had jobs and they were good to go, but... Uh, I couldn't even watch that. And they're like, oh, we're millionaires now. And the host is like, oh, you're a millionaire. Like, they won a million dollars. Like, I mean, I would love to win a million dollars, but get real. I mean, in the, in the grand scheme of things, that's really not a lot of money when you're buying an $800,000 house. And you live with your mother-in-law. But they did finally settle on, I think, a 400000 house. But, gee, even that, that's crazy. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm going to get so many thumbs downs. I took out some of the trash on my channel, which has kind of alleviated some of the thumbs down. But you know what? I want to talk about that just for a quick second. You know, on, on this whole lo my lottery channel, I get thumbs downs all the time. On my Send Pen Traveler channel, where I mean, I talk about some edgy crap, and I just talk about crap a lot of times. I get no thumbs downs. I get like 50 thumbs up on those videos. My coupon videos, 50 thumbs up. But my lottery videos... Doom stand, right? This guy sucks. I mean, I've learned to live with it. I don't care because I've realized now that the people that thumbs down me, I'm still making money off of it. And by the way, my I keep my earnings. I, it goes woo. July fourth, I made like five bucks from this channel, and then it went down, and I made like sixty three cents the next day, and then it goes woo, which I don't understand why. You know, but hopefully this video skyrockets me. So thumbs up, thumbs up. You can do it. If you're that guy out there that I think I banned who has another name out there, which I'm not even going to mention, um, he's got a thumbs down. But I'm soon going to get rid of YouTube probably. So just FYI. All right. I'm a crazy drunk man, Lotto King, right now. And I don't want to ruin my channel here. I mean, I got a good thing going on. And I don't want you people to think that, you know, I throw away my life with alcohol. But not really, no. I usually only let loose about one night a week, and it's usually Saturday night. I work. I worked. What did I work this week? I worked four days. I really only. I worked five hours, four hours this morning. So I only really worked about. And then I took an hour of work home. So I worked 45 physical hours, but then I got paid eight hours vacation for Monday. And I get a birthday holiday, because I was born on the 4th of July, so I get paid. 16 hours for Monday, so it's gonna end up being a pretty sweet paycheck. So I'm, I get paid hourly, by the way, in my job. So overtime, I work overtime a ton. So you know, I work a lot. So I, um, yeah, this is like therapy to me. I just let loose and I go on YouTube and rant. It just feels good. <laughs> I can't believe you're still watching this, but yes, go check that out. Oh, that's Kit Man. There's Kit Man's tail back there. I don't know where the heck all he is if Grease or Bub watches this, but <laughs> you can send me the Gamblers Anonymous hotline and the Alcoholics Hot Alcoholics Anonymous hotline, and I'll get help. But next weekend, if anyone's going to be in Atlantic City, I will be in Atlantic City next weekend for like four days. It's going to be awesome. I'm meeting a whole group of people. It's like my midsummer break. I'm excited. I'm actually taking off some time from work, and I definitely need it. It's a good break. So, yeah, I'm gonna win lots of money on those damn slots, and you know, just give the lottery a break for a little while. Okay. Anyway, holy crap! I just go off on a tangent. I almost dropped my phone. I'm drunk again, and. Thank goodness I got a freaking, you can't see it. Uh, it's kind of, yeah, you can see it there on the side. It's like clipped. I got one of them guy at work had some of these Japanese like like glass covers for your phone. And I dropped it and it actually cracked that cover. But my actual iPhone, which is good, but. <laughs> Cut me off. Someone come over to tell me to stop talking. All right, I am the Lotto King. Go check out this YouTube video. I think it's going to make us all win, and we can forget these sour tickets. All right, on.
but I'll say until next time. Um, hopefully I can continue with more of the giveaway um, winners tomorrow, because if not, I really don't have any videos planned. So if I don't get any, I will do a... Um, I'll pick up a ticket, give or take. I still got some cash back there. So we'll get something to go. The, the tickets have been sour. All right, I'm going to go now. <laughs> See everybody, thanks for watching, and thanks for being a part of my channel and listening to me rant on this Saturday night. Peace. But I'm going to tell you the truth one time in your life, whether you like it or whether you don't. So I'm just going to turn this over to the police.